Welcome back to Good Morning Vale. We're out here with a chilly morning in Lion's Head, but boy, the conditions are going to be great. We got eight inches reported up on Vale Mountain last night, uh, through yesterday's snow through today. So it's going to be a nice soft morning. And we're here to talk with our friend Matt Carroll from Double Diamond Ski Shop about some of the latest and greatest gear that he's got right here in their store in Lion's Head. Good morning, Matt. How are you, man? Good morning. Yeah. Well, we got some fresh snow and some cold temps, so it should be pretty good up there. Yeah. It's a, a, you know, we've been waiting for it the whole time and it's finally here. So pe people got to make sure they got their setup dialed in so they can get out there and enjoy a great day on the mountain. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, we were, you know, that storm yesterday, it was kind of cool to see it snowing all through the day. You know, it's, we haven't had a lot of that this season and uh, just to have a day where it snows all day. So it's, uh, it's pretty cool. And that's uh, kind of why I brought these skis. It's, you know, a lot of stuff up there is going to be kind of chopped up mm -hmm. and, uh, there's going to be still some fresh pockets, but uh, the skis I brought today are just kind of a little bit, a little bit wider than your true everyday ski, but not quite a full powder ski. So uh, yeah. just some good uh, crud busting skis. The crud busters. Okay, well let's dive into it. Let's. What's right. our first crud buster this morning? Well, we got the. Uh, this is the Nordica. This is the uh, ladies' ski, San the Santa Ana 100, okay. uh, 100 millimeters underfoot, uh, wood core. A little bit of rocker tip and tail, but uh, again, really good. And a lot of um, local ladies use this as an everyday ski, mm -hmm. but uh, definitely a little wider than uh, some ladies like as far as the uh, everyday performance and on groom stuff, but sure. uh, it's still got enough shape to it where it's gonna carve really well. Really a, just a truly good all mountain ski. Nice, nice. So that's the Nordica. Yeah, and then we've got a couple of men's skis here, starting off with a K2. This is the uh, K2 Pinnacle 105. Um, again, this one's going to be, uh, again, a true for a lot of locals, a good everyday ski. But uh, it does have a lot of rocker built into the tip. I don't know if you can see that, how, how much it curves. Yeah. The tip curves it back away from the body of the ski. Mm -hmm. um, this one's kind of cool because it's got a nano light core, which runs through the middle of the ski. And it's got the reinforced wood uh, closer to the edges to give you that power nice. on the edge. And this one does have... Um, what they call their all mountain rockers. So definitely a little more rocker in the tip, mm -hmm. some rocker in the tail, but still full camber underfoot. Sure. So it's still going to carve really well. That's great. And even though, you know, it's, it's got the rocker on it, but you said it's got the reinforced core, so it's really going to give you that snap on the turns. Exactly. It's yeah. going to hold really well. And then once you get on the, that groom stuff or the stuff, it's a little bit more set up. Yeah. Nice. Well, that sounds like a great ski. And then what do we got here from Liberty, our local Liberty, guys? Our local guys. We got the Origin 106. Um, and this one's a bamboo core with some uh, reinforced uh, carbon throughout. Um, again, some rocker tip and tail, camber underfoot. But a little bit lighter feel to it, uh, really lively, super nice in the softer conditions, yeah. and just a fun, really fun ski. Yeah, super playful. I demoed that a couple of weeks ago, and that thing is just flying all over the place. I mean, pretty versatile in a lot of different scenarios. Absolutely, and uh, again, could be used as an everyday ski if you wanted to. A uh, little wide for some people for an everyday, but uh, yeah. conditions like today, it's going to be great. And we do have demos in all of these yep. available, and uh, I expect we're going to be pretty busy putting out some uh, wider demos today. You bet. Got to go out and find those last few pockets of powder that are still hiding out there. <laughs> oh, yeah. They're out there. So. That's great. That's Matt Carroll from Double Diamond Ski Shop right here in Lion's Head Village, just a few steps from the Lion's Head parking structure. They're a full-service ski shop, so whether you're taking your skis in there to get them tuned up or renting a pair for the day or picking up some new gear it's the perfect spot we're going to take a look at uh, at the weather here in just a few minutes and so much more on good morning vale thanks for watching we'll be right back